Welcome back or welcome to My Cup of TV. I'm Jenny. And I'm Erin. So something new for us. Something different. Mm. Something that's been on my radar for a little while on Twitter. Okay. Then I accidentally saw a video. Right. And I was like, I like this. I think I should look at it more. So it's going to start. what's his name? Oh, I just want to know their names. That's how it starts. So I posted on Twitter. And um, Kenneth. Hi, Kenneth. <laughs> Kenneth, help me out. So SB19. Right. They are a boy group from the Philippines. Ooh. Um, I believe they're on my Twitter quite a bit because a few people I follow react to them. So I think Melanie reacts them possibly chloe may i know kenneth watches them so obviously they're they're coming up and i'm seeing stuff the algorithm so i've heard of them um heard of them to the point i can name them all i know oh god so i know and i think i can recognize who's who as well so like talk about subliminal messaging oh wow they've got you good i know so i know there is um Pablo, uh, Philippe, Justin, Stell, and I think there's only five, and there's Josh. Oh, <laughs> oh, I can see where this is going. Mm-hmm. How can you have a bias? When you haven't even looked into them, you have a problem. Okay. You'll see when you see him. The first one I'm going to show you is the one that I saw. Right. Before getting into K-pop, if you had said to me, what's your type? <laughs> you could have just drawn him. <laughs> oh my God, are there some ears involved? particularly but like he's absolutely <laughs> my type so yeah <sighs> oh no there is another member ken you know what else i was doing that? i'm thinking i feel like i'm missing someone yeah hmm. i'm intrigued i think i know who's who but i'm sure people let us know in the comments if i'm wrong so the video is Crimson, um, and it's not an MV, it's them, I say performing it, like in the street, I don't think they're like singing it, they're just like performing to it in the street. But it's the first time we've looked at someone outside of Korea. Yeah. So yeah, Filipino. Mm-hmm. Oh, right. Do I need to ask this now? Like. Have they come to the UK? Do they tour in Europe? Am I going to get know. annoyed? Because <laughs> I always go into it with, I'm going to be, see what I think. Like, inevitably, yeah. we end up. Well, I just, I, I enjoyed this. Um, but I'm interested to see what it's like. Because obviously we've got very used to music in Korean. So to have another language. We do get some, like, we're used to Japanese. Oh, Japanese as well, yeah. And we can hear the difference. You just kind of realise oh, there's so much that I'm missing. Just because oh, yeah. I don't... I was saying we got very into K-pop, but we were never set on not looking at music from other countries. Because no. I don't want to miss out. No. So uh, please remember to like, comment and subscribe in the comments. Uh, who is your SB19 bias? And give us you know, any info that you feel we need to have. It's probably all the info. <laughs> oh, that's a nice hair colour. I believe that is Stel. So black t shirt. Lip ring. Black t shirt is Josh. tattoos I'd get a headache doing that move
So I think that's Philippe. <laughs> <laughs> See why he's exactly my type? Yeah. <laughs> so I think with the longer hair is Pablo, and the blonde one is Justin, who I always think is kind of cute. I think cute too. Yeah. Yeah. Song you would hear in a club. Why you like him? <laughs> I can do that move, <laughs> but as effectively, probably not. Does this sound like rich boy? <laughs> <laughs> he's got oh. he's got a charisma in he yeah Pablo moment to have with a group. Yes. That was super fun. I know, right? I want to know what the lyrics are. Yeah. But you know what I mean? Like the song, I was like, oh no, I like this. I liked um, the start, like the at the beginning, there was like obviously auto-tune, drawly yeah. kind of speaky rap. Yeah. Bloody love that. <laughs> And just the yeah, it was head bangy but club. Yeah, it, it was cool. So, I mean, I thought the choreo was really cool. I loved the sound of the song. And you see, Josh is absolutely my type. Oh God, yeah, yeah. I also felt like you got a good look at everybody. There was only five though. Yeah. So when I was saying names. I said six. So I don't know. I'm sure people will let us know in the comments what's yeah. gone on there. It's Ken and Philippe that I'm not entirely sure on. The deep voiced rapper. I'm pretty sure on the others I'm right on who's who. That's where I bring JD in. This deep voiced rappers are her specialty. This is what Twitter is for. Shopping. Exactly. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can see why that made an impact on me. And I was like, oh, and now that's pushed yeah. it forward on my to-do list of checking like, them out. I heard, obviously they weren't singing then, but yeah. it sounded like there was a nice little bit of vocal. Yeah. As well. So um, I need another song so that I can hear that. Pretty please, and thank you. Yes, I have another one ready. Mm. So it's, I've heard of this song. Right. 
So I think it's their biggest or a big one for them, or maybe it's just a recent one that blew up. I don't know. But it's Gento. Is that ringing a bell for you? Like you've heard of I feel the word. Like, yeah. So yeah, I haven't seen this one. So. Good luck to you. Yeah. <laughs> if that first one's anything to go by. Oh, do you think they change their hair colours as often as they're doing K-pop and stuff? I've really loved that. I want to call it like blue orange, like the it was uh, bright orange. Light. Yeah, yeah. it was light, but with but without being. Yeah, yeah. It was just I loved it. Yeah, it's a statement. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, I don't want it to go away, but then I'm like, oh, but what else could we have? <laughs> Subs are on. We'll try and read some stuff. I can't promise nothing. Are they going to be dirty? Working in the mines. <laughs> English. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. Oh, hello. What? What? <laughs> We're not used to this. <laughs> Strip us and see you later. Okay, he's cute. He's so beautiful. And the jug. Oh. I've heard this. Have you? This core of it. I really like the styling for this. like a live performance this would be some massive dance break to this music at some point yeah okay <laughs> so you've heard that i definitely heard that that 
Gun dog. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Uh, yeah. I don't know how. As soon as it came on, I was like, yes, it like triggered something. something. Maybe I must have. I guess it's been used as an audio clip somewhere. Like, I. I don't know, but I'm so, <laughs> so thrilled. Yeah, catchy again. I love how, with a different language, how it's just such a different tone. Yeah. So get towards the end, when they were talking really fast oh my god it was just impressive and now i need to create a whole new way to butcher a language when i try to sing it oh yeah you've got that joy to look forward yeah. to yeah what what am um, i gonna make their beautiful language sound <laughs> bubbled up like um high budget mv as well that was cool i enjoyed the funny little bits yeah in it I think if that was in every MV I don't know if I would enjoy it as much but mm. then that might be for their kind of core audience yes what in jokes and yeah yeah but that was that was <laughs> fun oh my god Korea has made us super conservative when we're not <laughs> at all when he pulled his trousers down don't Strip, I, I'll say see you later. <laughs> I felt myself blush like, oh, sorry, I should have looked away. <laughs> no, you're doing this to me. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> and, I mean, too early to say I'm Josh biased. <laughs> Nothing is too early with I mean, you, to be honest. Yeah, I really... Perfection. Like, it's like he he's got your name written all over him that's what his tattoos are <laughs> yeah one million percent i'll tell you what was interesting though when he was rapping and he sat in the digger yeah i was like listening and thinking i don't know whether it's the way he raps or it's the language but the sounds do you know what i mean like some gravelly bits in there, but you know, yeah. you're like, I don't know whether that's his style or whether it's that's the way the language sounds. It's going to be interesting to see more and to see how that. I think the way to see that is if you have like a slower vocal, yeah, performance because you can you can gauge a bit more how some of the pronunciation is it's supposed to yeah it's supposed to sound and then. It, we probably need to put some research in. Yeah, watch like all the all MVs, of the stuff. All the performances. That <laughs> but then I'm using their names, assuming I'm right on who's who. <laughs> Pablo, his rap was so fast in places. It's like, wait a minute, he was really deep. No, no, he's uh, with the ponytail. Oh yes, you talking a baked potato to start yeah. with? I was like, <laughs> I like you. Yeah. <laughs> Because that first bit was in English. Yeah, but he had a bit of a facial hair. Oh, yeah. Which, again, we're now not used to. Yeah. Which is why it's nice to expand Mix it, it out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so who do we think it was then? But but towards the end, when he came back in, he was rapping again. It was like, wait a minute. Nothing switched up. Why are we going so fast? I wasn't ready. Do you like breathing, <laughs> sir? How do you do that? I believe it's Philippe, the deep voice rapper. I didn't recognise him from the first one. Yeah, he was the one in the bucket hat in the first one. Maybe that's why, because I remember thinking, oh, that's very short hair, but then if he had the hat on, I might not have. Because the hairstyles yeah. all track driver, which I know we like to change it up, but actually when you're getting to know God, yeah. that can be really, really super helpful. helpful. And, you know, there being five of them, not double figures. Yeah. It's also... And um, I see. I believe it's Justin. So cute! My God, <laughs> he's nice. Yeah, <laughs> and he was with a dog though. So well, he was the dog. <laughs> yes. I did read some lyrics, but there's a lot going on there. Um, they. I was aware they were on the screen. I felt like it was a work hard and you'll succeed type song because there, there was things like 
nothing comes easily like if you don't bleed that kind of nothing's gonna come easy if you don't work for it it's not just gonna come to you you need to I like, like we have we've achieved because we've worked kind of yeah thing. I love the line that um just so I think it was Josh then if that's with right with the names he said I've got stories that are now stories but like as he was putting out the blocks on like he's got levels of like growth and you know building up which I thought was an interesting like word play yeah um I love the little like floating coin that you (laughs) get in like video games and stuff and the choreo was cool oh yeah where they're like looped the yeah. arm over and and I thought that these I said Joan I like the styling mm, yeah definitely um, I would have liked a little bit more of the in the daylight bit just because that's when against like a dirty dust rock yeah. background those kind of outfits really pop but I appreciate the idea is that they were yeah grabbing this and they were working underground grinding all the time yeah but that where the music changed oh, up. Oh, yeah, into like a snake charmer. Yeah. There was some... See, that's what I mean. I feel really like on a hits. live performance, okay, maybe this is what K-pop has done to us, I'd be like, they would extend that part and it would be a dance break. Maybe even they'd each do a solo part. Oh. Or those hips wouldn't be so tame. Oh, them hips don't lie. <laughs> <laughs> We've been ruined. We're terrible. Myself. <laughs> Please don't judge us. <laughs> Crimson was because it's the one I'd seen. Yeah. Gento because I'd heard of it, so I knew it was a big deal. Um, I knew it was a big deal. <laughs> I know it's a big deal. <laughs> um, and Kenneth recommended Eyelaw. I'm assuming it said Eyelaw. Um, which there isn't an MV, but there was a live performance of it. Oh, that'll be fun to to see. So, oh, we've had a really good mix then. Like we've had a, like a street performance, yes, yeah. which is obviously casual and fun. Then we'll have had like a full production MV, MV yeah, and then we're gonna get a live. live. That's a nice balance yes. of. God, I'm good at this. So there's no lyrics, which is a shame, but we didn't do very well in the last one with lyrics. <laughs> Oh no, and he sounds lovely too. Oh, you're taken. Yeah. I knew he'd be a vocal king. Yeah. 
I've just realised there's people outside the bus. I need to know what this song is about. feel really bad that JD isn't here. Yeah. <laughs> Vocally, I feel like she would have had a full-on meltdown. Maybe we need to do another video when she is here about showing her these. Whoa. I just think my brain just kind of like split open when just all of them were yeah. layering in and the such different sounds and the powers in their vocals. Yeah. But then just to go and then just that must be I have no idea what that song's about I mean I could probably write a drama about it if I wanted to because <laughs> that's how my brain works but just the the emotion yeah and passion the passion a bit of loving pain mixed in yeah Ooh, Jesus like that was that was amazing that was my favourite yeah, that, yeah, I think it might be my favourite, but I think we've got, that's a very different style of song to the other two. So, do you know what I mean? You couldn't really put them in. No, but I just wasn't expecting that. I was no. going in like, oh, we're going to get some, I feel like we're going to get some vocals because you could hear in a couple of bits that there were some like. Nice vocals, hype. yeah. Yeah, but I didn't think that we were going to get. Yeah. All of that, I was thinking. Oh. oh, so you're not just a rapper, you can sing. Wait, but you're not just a rapper, you can sing too. You're are you even a rapper now or you're a singer? Because <laughs> who are you all? Yeah. How are you? Because I already like from um Gento in particular, I was like, okay, so Justin and Stell are vocalists, and I feel like the other three are rappers, but but. Should we be are we surprised that they can also sing? Yeah. I just didn't expect that level of yeah. vocal. Yeah, from all, all of, them. of them, and in such different 
so different because I said, oh, he's obviously like Vocal King. And I yeah. thought that was going to be. And then it was like, you dumb bitch. <laughs> <laughs> like, look at the rest of it. And honestly, I'm blown away. <gasps> I will say. Live. If I was picking a favourite voice, again, all of them were amazing. Pablo's voice. I'm listening to him going, my God, give me a rock ballad. You give me just a big, massive rock ballad. Who had the orangey hair? Stell. Stell. Pablo's long hair. Oh, yeah, he was... Do you know what I mean? Rock ballad. That oh. voice. My God, the gravel. Yeah. The power. So, I love Justin's, but yeah. I actually think that Stell... You know what I say about Sungmin? There was a tone. Yeah. He had... Like how he arched some of the vocals that he did, yeah. there was a reverberating tone of power in them that I would just it drew me in. Yeah. Whilst everyone else was singing, but it was like I could still hear. Yeah. That. Wow. Oh my god. On the topic of uh, Stell, the shirt need it. <laughs> oh yeah, so beautiful. <laughs> This is where um, just the industries have ruined me. Yeah. I could see a phone through the bus, and in the back of the phone, I was like, that's a photo card. They have photo cards. Yes, I was about to say, they have photo cards. <laughs> Why is that broken? I can't believe how long it took me to realise there were other people there. <laughs> um, yes, wow, what a lovely song. And again, I love that you... You can hear the difference of the language. Yes. There are certain sounds that they make that I don't hear in English, Korean, Japanese. Justin, I don't know whether it was how the word is pronounced, whether he rolled, it sounded like an R. Yeah, like a rolling R, yeah. The sounds like that, you're like, oh, I don't, we don't have those in, no. in English. I said, I don't recognise them in Korean or Japanese. So it's just those little things that make it different. It's like... A slightly higher pitch language, maybe, and that might be. I don't know. It's not a language I think I've heard a lot of. I'm assuming it's Filipino, so I know they do have a lot of languages in the Philippines. Yeah. I think English is also one of their official languages, but. Yeah, but I think they do have a lot of languages there. So that would be really interesting then. Do you then get like a. Do they sing in multiple languages? Yeah. Because of that? I don't know. With, then hybrids of... I need to know how much involvement they have in their mm. songwriting, any producing. Does anyone play musical instruments? <gasps> don't um, even. Don't even. Because I was like, oh, that's got some good instrumental like, in the background. So did they have to compose that as well? Don't even give Josh a guitar. Just don't do it. Oh, you'd be dead. I'd be dead, dead. Like... Not even, you, there'd be no peace you'd be resting in. Well, thank you for that. Thank yeah. Thank you for that. I'm glad I pushed that forward on the list. Yeah, that was very... Thank you, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, so God. that is our <laughs> first time watching SB19. So thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.